I'm providing for my daughter right now. What the fuck are you talking about? I've really made it. Sorry, bread to my comments already. Cooter free. Go for him. Braids are curly hair. Curly hair. Love style. Look, you shouldn't have done that interview. Um, I just find it funny that a lot of people think are telling me what I should and shouldn't do. Like, and just to clarify some things up, um, when I did that interview, I didn't have that paperwork. That paperwork was public and it was online, yes. But I didn't have it. I haven't even read all of it. So when I got to the interview, it was already there. They had Vlad had his team printed out and they handed it to me. And it was like, oh, that's the indictment or whatever. I was like, oh, shit. It wasn't until we started filming that he asked me to go on a page and read it. Like, he put me on the spot. And I was kind of like, I didn't know what the fuck I was going to read. He already had it in his head that he was going to. I guess, asked me to read this page and the, that, those two paragraphs or whatever. I didn't know. Usually they act, they sent um, a list of the questions or things that they were going to ask me about. And that was not, like, the indictment or anything like that was not on the list. So I was kind of taken off guard about that. But as far as everything else... You know that I spoke on, but that maybe I shouldn't have read that. But I didn't know what the fuck was on that paper. That I, when I started reading it, I was like, "Oh shit!" But um, as far as everything else, like the way I met Danny and everything else, that's my fucking life. So I can fucking speak on it. I can speak on how I met him. I can speak on shit that's happened to me being with him. I can speak on all of that. So for everybody saying that, I can can suck my dick. 